Katie, Ella, wh what do you guys want to do in that relay? <laughs> Put our hand on the wall first for Stanford. Um, I think there's a lot of energy that goes into the first night, and it's just one race, and um, we're trying to get things rolling for our team and um, get ready, get into the meet mode. And um, we definitely felt good when we were warming up, and um, it went well. So. Yeah. Katie, after you didn't have the swim you wanted on that relay at Pac-12s, what was it like to get to get that chance to lead off to kind of set the tone? Yeah, uh, I was definitely very happy that I got a second chance to prove myself and what I could do. And um, these past two weeks, I've kind of been working on preparing for this moment, and that with that came a lot of confidence. And um, yeah, I was definitely very happy that I could get a second chance and kind of. To show everybody what I should have done at Pac-12s. Yeah. What has the mood, the focus been like the last two weeks for you, for you girls? Um, it's been a lot of fun. I mean, a bunch of us got wiped out with some sort of flu virus, but other than that, we have been enjoying having um, a little bit more relaxed practices, um, been doing more speed focus stuff, just like generally in the taper mode. Um, we really did a good job this year of working all the way through um, up until a couple weeks ago and so we were um, really able to enjoy a taper and Greg was able to give us sufficient rest um, knowing that we still had tons and tons of endurance behind us so um, it was it was really fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah definitely a lot more energy and excitement as the weeks kind of progressed and with rest also comes more energy, so. Ella, how do you feel? Um, I feel great. I, um, every time you come to a meet like this, it's like everything that you have done, you put behind you and you are in the moment. Um, and I think that's kind of the best thing about swimming is that you step up on the blocks and like everyone's at an even playing field at that point. Um, and you just have a chance to show all the hard work that you've done. and um, Even if you just had the flu. Exactly. Do you guys do anything, like once taper starts so the last couple of weeks, do you guys do anything special like as a team outside of the pool to kind of, I don't, I don't know, bond or whatever else you might do? Um, I think one of the best things about taper is um, Greg's speeches. <laughs> um, yeah. If you ever get the chance to listen to Greg speak, um, it, he's probably like the most motivational person I know and that probably also comes along with the fact that he's the one pushing us every single day. Um, but we get really excited to have our team meetings where we get our gear um, for the meet um, and sit down and go through the itinerary and um, have him kind of motivate us for everything that's to come for the next couple of days and everything that we worked for all season. Katie, after the way this meet went last year for you, what's this like just being at this meet again, considering it wasn't the meet you wanted as a freshman? Yeah, um, I think there's a lot more comfort coming mm -hmm. here this year as I have one meet under my belt, so coming, um, I don't feel as nervous. I think the nerves are kind of transferred into excitement as I know what to expect and how the meet will flow. And I also think that being able to be on this relay is kind of an extra thing for me to experience. And I think it just got everything off to off on the right now. So. How about that butterfly? Yeah, about that butterfly. Something new? It is. It's something that I've wanted to do for a little bit now. Um, I talked to Greg earlier in the year about trying it out and he was more so focused on the mile. He said he'd let me swim it and then that kind of progressed into me getting to swim it here which I'm really excited about and it's really cool to train alongside Ella every day and we push each other and yeah, I'm excited to try out the event. Yeah. Ellie, you talked about Greg's speeches. Did, did he say anything specifically about relays? Were you guys a little extra motivated? I know that Pac-12 obviously was good for you guys, but also Cal won a bunch of the relays. Um, how much of a motivating factor is that, and did Greg talk about that as well? Yeah, I mean, um, relays are a really great way to bring the team together, and especially starting the meet off that way. It, it was definitely... Um, a priority to swim for each other, um, which I think your best swims come out of you when you're doing it for everyone around you. Um, and I mean, obviously it's never fun to get second a bunch of times in relays, and so there is a little bit of motivation um, behind that to like bring that back to our team.
Cool. Good luck tomorrow, guys. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.